Vanessa Williams is an American singer, actress, model, producer, and dancer. She gained recognition as the first black woman to win the Miss America title when she was crowned Miss America 1984. Wikipedia Born March 18, 1963, age 61 years, The Bronx, New York Spouse, Jim Scripp, M. 2015-2021, Rick Fox, M. 1999-2005, Ramon Hervey II, M. 1987-1997 Children, Sasha Gabriella Fox, Jillian Hervey, Devin Hervey, Melanie Hervey. Parents, Helen Williams, Milton Augustine Williams Jr. Height, 1.68 meters. Siblings, Chris Williams. Vanessa Williams' net worth $20 million. Early life and education. Vanessa Lynn Williams was born in Terrytown, New York, with a birth announcement that read, Here she is, Miss America. She was raised in Millwood, New York. A paternal great-great-grandfather was William Fields, an African-American legislator in the Tennessee House of Representatives. Williams is also of English and Welsh descent. Her mother Helen Tinch met her father Milton Augustine Williams Jr., 1935-2006, while both were music education students at Fredonia State Teachers College in the late 1950s. They became elementary school music teachers in separate districts after marriage. Milton also served as the assistant principal of his school for an extended period of time. Williams was raised Catholic, the religion of her father. Her mother, who had been raised Baptist, converted to Catholicism when she married. Williams was baptized at Our Lady of Grace Church in the Bronx. Her mother played the organ at St. Teresa's Church in Briarcliff Manor for weddings and at Mass, and Williams used to assist her mother by turning the pages of sheet music. Williams and her younger brother Chris, who later became an actor, grew up in Westchester County, a predominantly white middle-to-upper-class suburb of New York City. Williams believes she may have been the first African-American student to go from the first grade to the twelfth grade in the Chappaqua Central School District. She attended Robert E. Bell Middle School, as did her children years later. Williams revealed that the shop and home economics teachers, Mr. and Mrs. Fink, were still there when her children attended. A child of music teachers, Williams grew up in a musical household, studying classical and jazz dance, French horn, piano, and violin. She was offered the Presidential Scholarship for Drama to attend Carnegie Mellon University during the college application period, one of twelve students to receive it but decided instead to attend Syracuse University on a different scholarship. In 1981, Williams joined Syracuse's College of Visual and Performing Arts, Department of Drama, as a musical theater major. She stayed at Syracuse through her second year until she was crowned Miss America 1984 in September 1983. In May 2008, Syracuse granted Williams a Bachelor of Fine Arts degree. According to Syracuse News, Williams earned the remaining credits for her degree through industry experience and her substantial performances on stage and screen. Williams delivered the 2008 Convocation Address, telling Syracuse seniors to treasure this moment. These days are irreplaceable and are the beginning of the rest of your life. Career Music Williams first received public recognition for her musical abilities when she won the preliminary talent portion of the Miss America pageant with her rendition of Happy Days Are Here Again, Williams would later be crowned Miss America 1984. For years later in 1988, Williams released her debut album, The Right Stuff. The first single, The Right Stuff, found success on the R&B chart, while the second single, He's Got the Look, found similar success on the same chart. The third single, Dreamin', was a pop hit, becoming Williams' first top 10 hit on the 1989 Billboard Hot 100, peaking at number 8, and her first number 1 single on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart. The album reached gold status in the U.S. and earned her an NAACP Image Award and three Grammy Award nominations, including one for Best New Artist. Her second album The Comfort Zone became the biggest success in her music career. The lead single Running Back to You reached top 20 on the Hot 100 and the top position of Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart on October 5, 1991. Other singles included The Comfort Zone, No. 2 R&B, Just for Tonight, No. 26 Pop, a cover of the Isley Brothers' Work to Do, No. 3 R&B, and the club-only hit Freedom Dance, Get Free. 
The most successful single from the album, as well as her biggest hit to date, is Say the Best for Last. It reached number one in the United States, where it remained for five weeks, as well as number one in Australia, the Netherlands, and Canada, and was in the top five in Japan, Ireland, and the United Kingdom. The album sold 2.2 million copies in the U.S. at its time of release and has since been certified triple platinum in the United States by the RIA, gold in Canada by the CRIA, and platinum in the United Kingdom by the BPI. Williams performed the song live at the 1993 Grammy Awards ceremony. The Comfort Zone earned Williams five Grammy Award nominations. The Sweetest Days, her third album, was released in 1994 to highly favorable reviews. The album saw Williams branch out and sample other styles of music that included jazz, hip-hop, rock, and Latin-themed recordings such as Bet You Never and You Can't Run, both written and produced by Babyface. Other singles from the album included the adult contemporary and dance hit The Way That You Love and the title track. The album was certified platinum in the U.S. by the RIA and earned her two Grammy Award nominations. Other releases include two Christmas albums, Star Bright in 1996, and Silver and Gold in 2004, Next in 1997, Everlasting Love in 2005, and The Real Thing in 2009, along with a Greatest Hits compilation released in 1998, and a number of other compilations released over the years. Chart performances from subsequent albums, motion picture and television soundtracks have included the songs Love Is, which was a duet with Brian McKnight, the Golden Globe and Academy Award-winning Colors of the Wind, Where Do We Go From Here, and Oh How the Years Go By. Personal Life Williams and her mother Helen co-authored a memoir titled You Have No Idea, published in April 2012. In the book, Williams discusses her childhood, rise to fame, and personal struggles, including life with type 1 diabetes, including the fact that she was sexually molested by a woman when she was 10 years old. She spoke candidly about having an abortion while she was in high school. Williams is a practicing Catholic, something she spoke about on the ABC News program Focus on Faith, with Father Edward L. Beck. Williams has been married three times. She married Ramon Hervey II at St. Francis Xavier Catholic Church in 1987 just a few years after giving up her Miss America crown and gave birth to her first child at that time. Hervey was a public relations specialist who was hired to resuscitate her career after her resignation. They had three children, Melanie, Jillian, and Devon. They divorced in 1997. She married NBA basketball player Rick Fox in 1999. They had one daughter, Sasha Gabriella Fox. They divorced in 2004. In 2015, she married Jim Scripp, a businessman from Buffalo, New York at St. Stanislaus Catholic Church, after receiving a church annulment of her first marriage. The couple quietly divorced in 2021. Her daughter, Jillian Hervey, is an American singer, dancer, and member of the group Lion Babe. Williams is a grandmother.